Hello, good morning, good afternoon, where you are, I don't know, I don't care, yes I do, a little bit. Welcome to some more Blitz action with my croaky voice! Ah! And the aim of today is to get my rating above 2500 again. So I've tried this on numerous occasions. I'm kind of like dipping in and out of uh, this 2500 ride as we go along. So we're just going to see how, how we get on today. And I'm going to try some three minute chess. It might be a long video, I don't know, but you can always press stop, can't you? If you don't like it, if you're bored, if I'm pissing you off already, press stop. That's a good idea. Um, hope you enjoy it though, of course. So I'm just going to see who's out there in the world of chess players, see if I can get a game on chess.com in their lovely new board they have here, which um, looks very nice, I have to say. And we'll see, we'll see who I can play a game against. Right, let's... Uh, Let's see if we can get some games. So I'm just going to challenge some people. Maybe people are going to run scared. You know, maybe they don't want to play me. You know, a little bit of fear in their, fear in their game. Uh, I'm going to play Try Free Minute uh, again, just because I enjoy it. It's nice, quick and fast. I don't really know what's going on myself when I play, because it is a bit too quick. But it's enjoyable. Now, I would like... I'm just challenging now, waiting for a game. Now, I would say I'd love to... Um, you guys, if if you can like the videos and subscribe to the channel, that would be great. That would help me out, and that would probably help me do more videos in the future. So that is something I can only say. Please like and subscribe to my channel. It can only do good. Okay, right, so here we go. And um, my opponent, quite a decent rating. So, how many games do I need to win? Come on, Harry! Oh, yeah, Harry the H-Pawn. Oh, yeah, come on! Oh, yeah! Aren't we loving it? Oh, look at Harry go! Harry is having the time of his life. do 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 Okay, well, I, I quite like this position because I have a nice control over this important f5 square so i'm going to try and come in on this square here this makes a lot of sense and his bishop on g7 that is what is called a caged beast not really a beast it's just a, a really stupid caged piece that one where is that ever going to go he's going to have to go rook e8 bishop f8 to get the game the piece into the into the game now my plan with my manoeuvring with my knight. God, this is a bit positional, isn't it? Isn't it? Is to get my knight situated on this beautiful f5 square. So maybe I can just go about doing that now. I just want to go knight to f5, maybe g4 to ensure my knight is going to stay there. And positionally speaking, this is rock and roll. But he does have a little bit of initiative over here. How do I break through? It's all good playing positionally. Oh, what about this? What about moving my king over to the king side? What about just this? I like this idea because it's safer over here. Avoiding the avalanche which is coming at me over here. This might be a ridiculous plan um, as well. Okay, well, I'm always happy to exchange queens because my knight is beautiful on this square. As I've already discussed. I mean, look at it. That is just what we call an absolute beauty. And now I need to break open somewhere else. So this is really a game about, uh, I'm hoping, the positioning of my knight. But he, he has got some good space over here as well. I probably shouldn't have allowed this so much. And he's closing everything up now. Uh, should I have allowed that? Maybe maybe I shouldn't have allowed that. Okay. Um a bit silly. Well, okay, it's quite hard to break through. Okay, I've got to, got to move quicker as well. Right, okay. Not going... Uh, I know he's got Rook here coming. I should not have allowed all this play. Really slacking me. Right, okay, so what am I going to do? I'm going to, going to try to play... I think I am playing E4 here. This is, uh, this is what I need to do. And try to use my pawns in the centre. Okay, so his bishop's back in the game. And he's found a good square for it. I should have controlled this a lot better than the way I've been controlling it. But still, I've got Derek now. And Derek uh, might be lost <laughs> after Rook C6. Oh, blooming heck, this game's going horribly wrong. Okay, what have I done to my lovely position? Right, 
Time to put on the hustle hat. I don't want to lose the first game. No. No, Simon. Okay, time to put on the hustle hat. That pawn was a goner anyway. Now, I think, yeah, he should obviously get rid of this one. And we're going to get a rook and pawn ending. Um, which I'm a pawn down. Which is not what I had in mind when I dominated his pieces earlier on. Okay, well, I need to move quick. Obviously, his pass pawn is looking a bit dangerous. I try to get my rook behind that pass pawn and uh, play it like this. Oh, no, why did I go there? What on earth is that? That's a ridiculous move. I've, I thought my king was somewhere else. Ah, oh, dear, that was just absolutely rubbish game, actually. I should have even been doing And he doesn't want to play again? Oh, don't annoy me. Don't annoy me. Oh, this could be a long, this could be a long video. This could be a long video, couldn't it? Um, this, uh, uh, if it's going, if I'm going to try to get to 2,500, I could be here all day. Okay, come on, let's just win a game now. Right, that last game was appalling. I kind of let him get too much space on the queen side, and even though I had this brilliant knight, I mean, I really should not have lost that game. That was awful. Okay, let's bounce back though. Now I'm going to go for what is called the hippo where you apparently place your pieces to make it look like a hippo. As you can see, it is a spitting image of a hippo. If you had a picture of a hippo and you had this position, would you know the difference? I don't actually see the hippo here, but okay, you can see it's got its bumps, it's got its, it's, got its things, and it's a very solid opening, this one, but I'm quite cramped, and I normally play this with G5, Knight g6, and hopefully Freddy 5 will come in. Oh, he's going mental. Oh, he's going mental. I, I mean, I, I, of course he can play like this. There's nothing wrong all the way he's playing. Um, but I shouldn't be too scared of this, should I? Let's block up. Stop him ever breaking here. Got an extra piece. I don't believe his sacrifice should be sound. But in Blitz Chess, it's all about who's got the initiative. And, well, my opponent is trying to gain the initiative here. Well, let's, let's eliminate some more pieces from the board. And he's always trying to get his queen over here. Obviously, I'd love to get rid of this knight. Because that is an annoying piece. So I'm just going to try... Okay, I'm not even too concerned about him taking that. But I'll, I'll move it anyway. Just, I'll try to be greedy and hold on to my extra material here. He's got a bit of an initiative, I must say. Um, can't go messing this one up again. But I have got an extra piece, so as long as I don't do anything completely ridiculous here, it should be okay. 2,500, so now it's going to take me more games. What's that? You can't play moves like that. You, you, I mean, this guy, this guy's gone, he's gone bonkers. I mean, uh, what's he been? What's this guy been smoking, eh? Where can I get some? Wait, okay, well, I, I don't believe this. I mean, he's only attacking with two pieces. He's probably going to check checkmate me now in a, in a beautiful way. But I mean, it can't. This attack can't surely work, can it? Can it? Can it? It can maybe. Oh dear, I forgot he's taking there. Oh, I'm playing so badly. Oh dear. And now, um. Okay, I've got this one. I have to give back. Oh, no, I'm not giving back a piece, am I? He's got Rook here coming as well. I'm playing so... Oh, this is a bad day in the office. Right, keep your cool here. Keep your cool and defend. So if I take here, he's going Rook here, check. And that is really annoying. And otherwise, he's taking here. What have I done? What am I doing? Okay, well, let, let's... That knight was doing absolute... Nothing, should I say, in a polite way. Um, and, okay, okay, come on, let's keep it calm. I want to go knight f6. I've got two extra pieces. You have to say, you know, you have to give him a little, some credit here. He's he, he's having a go, isn't he? Come and have a go if you think you're hard enough, they say in some circles. Um, and now, well, look, I'm not the kind of guy who likes to defend. So... I'm going to try to start a counter-attack here. Take on g3, and at least I can get some kind of counter-attack going, rather than just sit there and uh, I'll let him spank my bottom. I I don't really don't want to allow that to happen. 
I'm going to try and get some counterattack going, but my counterattack is probably not very good. Probably not very good. I don't really know what that statement meant, but okay. And now he's ganging up here. Oh, flipping heck. Okay, let's get the queens off because otherwise this is looking too dangerous. Uh, still a little bit dangerous. So I'll, I'll, I'll give him that. And now, what should I do? Do I use my pawns? It's an annoying pin and he has pawn here coming. I'll just try... Hmm. Do I get rid of one pawn and try to win the ending? Okay, let's try this. I mean, I freaked out a little bit here. Time as well. Some days you play well and some days you play like a turnip. An unripe turnip. And today, oh my goody giddy god. I'm playing like a fucking idiot. There we go. Oh. Flipping neck. That was, and I, I don't you just love it when you lose games like that. I've got to turn off this chat because you know you're playing rubbish, and you get someone saying um, lots of laugh. Ha 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 ha. This is guy a woman GM. I've got to turn off the chat. It's embarrassing. But that that was that was two games we really should have. I don't believe this guy's play. It maybe sometimes takes a while to to get swinging, and sometimes you play well, and sometimes you just play badly uh, this is the thing you know when I'm playing well I really think I can sort of uh, go through anyone and defeat anyone but um, when you're playing badly it just uh, everything just goes wrong you know it's like life I think uh, it's a mental thing isn't it chess obviously I think the mentality of chess is really understated I'm just trying to play another game here I'll, I'll be nice to finish on on one win at least um, if I can, if I can get someone to play me, um, and this is this quite important thing, you know, you've got to be mentally in the right frame of mood to uh, to play. Uh, definitely. What am I doing here? I don't know. I'm trying to get used to this new new setup. Playing. Okay. Let's. I'm, so I'm just trying to. I'm just trying to uh, get as many games as I can. See if we can at least finish with one win. Next time I lose, that'll be it. Twenty five hundred. Just can't do it. I mentioned this 2600 last time. Well, it's going to take me a long time to get there, isn't it? <laughs> That'd be a lifetime's ambition. Okay, well, I can't get a game at the moment. Most uh, frustrating. I'll take on anyone. So let's see. Lots of people being idle. The guy who played me doesn't want to play anymore. He wants to say, I won 2 0 against the GM. Ha 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 ha. I mean, what an awful tactic at the end there. That was really embarrassing. I mean, how winning was I in that game? I mean, when I don't play three miniatures, I will try to play some longer time and I will analyse the games a bit better. You know, I might stick on the engine, as they say, to see where I went wrong. Because I think now on this chess.com, I love the board. Isn't that board juicy? Looks like a very juicy board to me. I will try to have a look at, um, you know analyze the games and go over the games that I play but at the moment I'm just in the mood to play a bit of uh, a bit of blitz uh, well I was in the mood I'm not, not really in the mood anymore um, like I mentioned before if you can like and subscribe that would be great it will help me do more of these videos I need to try to build up subscribership a bit and also if you want to support it in other ways go to um, the um, okay, I've got a game against Robert Fontaine, Grandmaster from France, who I know, uh, I know a bit. Nice guy, uh, and nice to play another Grandmaster. So let's see if I am going to continue my rot, or if things will get better. So I'm going to play the Dragon, which seems like a, a nice aggressive way to bounce back. My opponent playing very quickly here. I think this line is meant to be about equal he's playing quite positionally I'm, i mean in these type of structures you're supposed to start shoving barry up the board so this is uh something i can consider doing at some point let's attack his queen he might not notice it you never know yeah robert robert's a very strong player he used to be married to catalana lano um and he's involved quite a lot in the french uh, chess scene. Um, I think he works for a sh one of the French sites, a shack, is it? Something like this. And what we have here is, well, this is quite a, a solid position here where he's going to try to swap off dark square bishops and gain some small edge, which is uh, 
very sensible way for my opponent to play. I'm hoping, on the other hand, I'm going to have this C3 square to uh, to maneuver into at some point. But of course, my I don't want to go knight e5 because it gets kicked by this move, and I want to try to get my pieces into c3. So this is my, and he's coming into c6 on the other hand. Makes a lot of sense. Okay. Well, if he does go there, I can go e5, and that's a move that must help me. Okay. So let's play in, attack this pawn of his. And he's got a very simple plan, hasn't he? Just attacking here. Okay, let's let's go let's go for some annoyance moves. Okay, oh dear. Well, that was annoying, but it was only annoying for me. Okay, this is not going so well. The story of the day. Sometimes it just ain't happening. Okay. <laughs> I mean I'm bishop b5 just looks like a, a decent move, but I suppose I've got c2 on pre then. So hence why he's going here. Right, how do I okay, I can't can I play this move? That looks... No, uh, this and I trap my own. Okay, right. So, um, if I go here, here, I have to move my rook. If I go here, maybe I should go here, give up this pawn and try to get my queen into the position somehow. So, just try to get my queen into f5, something like this, try to get active along this way, but... I've lost the pawn. Oh dear, is it going to be one of those days where you just lose every game you play? 2,500. Oh, will I ever get back there? I was back there the other day as well. Um, right, so, okay, well, let, let's let's go for the ending, if I can. Is this, uh, if I can get the ending, get pawn back, this is not so bad. Not so bad. My pieces are quite well positioned for the ending. So my opponent obviously not going into it. And... I have some frets going on to my king, don't I? I'm a bit concerned about something nasty happening after that move. Bishop e4. And my pieces get kicked away. Knight here, bishop e4. And I need to keep controlling this square. So, um... Oh, dear. Okay, I'm going to come back. It's a bit negative way to play. And just, uh try to go oh he goes here anyway oh, oh well it's just such a bad i mean what's happening in my chest today i have to check and go d5 this might save me but then he, okay might save me and now desperately try to get these rooks off the board the less pieces i can swap the less attacking chances he has but my time is very bad now so got to quicken up now quicken up and I mean, even the endings, I'm not totally convinced about because you can win my A pawn and then you have a passed A pawn. So I haven't got time to worry about that now anyway. Just put my knight back on F6 and play quick. This is the key to trying to survive this one and get my queen in the game somehow. Um, I mean, if I get the queens off, it might not be so bad because my pawns are on dart squares over on the queen side so his bishop cannot attack them so it might not be tragic let's find out so i'm gonna attempt to swap the queens off um and he's gonna go for this pawn here um all right now i have to well if i go there he just takes there so let's well i'm trying to create some create some play somehow because he is eliminating all my pawns so I want to open his king up. 20 seconds left. Not a lot of time to do this. Oh, Scheiser. That was a big checker you would have had. He has queen h4. Which, uh, not good. Okay. Not good. Not good at all. Okay. I have to move quick. And now he's winning my knight. No. No. Ah, oh, dear. This, this, is a, this is painful for me to watch, you know. I don't know about you guys, but are, are, are you feeling the pain? I'm feeling the pain here. Okay. Oh, 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 dear. Right. Next time I lose a game, that is it. Right, okay. That is it. Let's just try to win one game. Okay, what is this he's playing? I don't even know what that move is. I'm out of my theory on move three. Okay, well, let's, um, 
let's try to just develop and checkmate him. Okay, I'm just going to play. I'm going to play quick attacking moves here. I'm not worrying about anything. So this is just try to attack the guy. Let's see what happens. Eh? Looks like fun, but it might be rubbish. Okay, here maybe. And now what about? Oh, let's just do this. What about that for a move? Just offering both my pieces, and I just want to castle and get to his king. What is this position? <laughs> my opponent is saying nice. Um, I don't know if he means it or not. Um, and now he's threatening knight here. Okay. In we go. I've got to come knight g5. I don't know. Well, it's an interesting idea. I mean, what is this game? Okay, so now I have bishop a3 checks. This is... Uh, one of the ideas here. This is quite dangerous for him, isn't it? Bishop here. Okay, what on earth is happening here? If I check king here, if I go f3 first, let's try this one. Because I need to get a rook d1 in. This is the idea. One, I want to play rook d1, so I need to block his bishop out. So pawn takes, bishop a3 check, and then rook d1 check. It's all gone a bit mental. I had queen takes pawn there check as well. Wasn't that just winning? Maybe that was just mate. Oh dear. Okay, well, let, let's take this one. I've still got a massive attack here um, with this check coming in and a rook coming to d1. And I've got knight e6 check as well. Oh, yeah, come on. There is a time when your confidence gets a bit better. And when you're winning all the pieces on the board, then that is one of the times. So, okay, well, I mean... If I lose this, then <laughs> there is going to be pandemonium going on. I mean, how many pieces up am I? Well, I'm a, I'm a queen for a knight up, so, I mean, this would be really embarrassing here to not win this one. I mean, not just embarrassing, but really embarrassing. Ah, oh, yes, that was a fun game. That was more like it. Okay, he's got to go. Okay, thanks. Enjoy, Jib. Okay, good stuff. Right, well, I think we'll leave it there. It was a bit short and sweet. Not the best of blitz sessions. I mean, um, just because I'm finding it a bit tough to get a game there. And it's best to leave on a win, isn't it? You don't want to see me smash up the computer, buy a new computer, and miss loads of videos for a while. Um, I'm be off for a week now. Again, please like and subscribe. I'll leave you with a little song, that my rap song that was done for me by Michael. Thank you, Michael. And I will catch you all again very soon, hopefully. Bye for now. Biggie. Hey, yo, he just ginger GM with hair like a ninja taking you out and chess. He the best all day, every day, cause that's what he about. Shoving Harry up the bar with powers like he the man with the sword. Taking out all these doors, bringing Freddy to the party, getting hella naughty, turning up off the YouTube material. Cause the rest are silly jokes, you already know. Cause that's just how it goes, yo. Cause he's on a row, like he's on a row. Welcome to the chess master, motherfuckers, kind of bow, yo. Oh, yeah.